Hello? Okay, okay. Hey. That's crazy. This is been me for that moment, and then I'm able to go right back. So no. dumb. Oh, yeah. Love you. Uh, Love you. Yeah. Too, sis. And I will turn my son. How did my back, my back, my back? It really hurts. Uh, calls here and there, so I'm just waiting for somebody to see if they see what somebody say. Okay, I'm going to try this again. Last night I was trying to tell you that something happened with somebody, one of those, uh, one of those, uh, I don't know what they are, but uh, some people that will be like, you know, first, uh, the first people to send me your cash app gets this, gets that, or whatever like that, and mm. messed up thing is somebody just sent me 2000 on my cash app, but you know how it is, there's no way for me to try to accept that, so now I have $2,000 pending on a cash app card that I can't even use. Okay. Oh my gosh, it's black to so, um Hello? Yes, we're back, we're back, we're back. Hello? Hey. Dang now ha No, that has to be Hello? wrong. What? We have hundred and twenty viewers. Okay, that has to be wrong. No, that's cool. I'm just telling you what Way back, way back, way back. Yeah, so if y'all didn't see earlier, um, my my live got suspended for a moment because my fiance picked me up because someone asked me, they'll ask him, how strong is he? Like, how strong he is? And he literally picked me up. Like three different ways, over his head. like over his head, over his shoulder, like all that. So when he picked me up, I guess because my butt or something was showing, or I don't know what it was, but my big butt was showing or something, <laughs> and TikTok suspended the live. But I'm able to go right back, so it's fine. He's on the phone right now, so that's why he's not in the in the background. But yeah, he picked me up to show his strength, to prove his strength. <laughs> And my TikTok live got suspended. <laughs> He's a very strong man. He is also a professional fighter. He is a professional. The strength is real. He is a professional um, mixed martial arts artist. I don't know the right word. Mixed martial artist. Mm -hmm. So he is professionally just like strong <laughs> like like yeah yeah um yeah hey purify love um yeah he picked me up and tiktok suspended the live <laughs> literally he is um really strong and um <laughs> that was crazy but yeah we're back so it's all good yeah um Thank you. Yeah, so he is a um, really strong man. He is very physically fit. He is only 10 pounds bigger than me, but he's taller, stronger. And yeah, so. Hey, Mocha. Yeah, so when my fiance picked me up, um, I guess because my booty or whatever was showing, maybe my big buttocks were showing oh so <laughs> tiktok has been the live but yeah we back he's on the phone right now so um Love you. wait he's right here this app is too sensitive it is too sensitive he's right here hey hello hello back <laughs> tiktok say in as usual that's why I don't go out on TikTok, really. Because it's like... Are you on TikTok? Yeah, we are. Oh. <laughs> TikTok said, we was just playing. 
gas. This is my yeah, fiance. Yeah, TikTok, y'all full of crap, man. We got a, <laughs> we got a whole 12-year-old back there. Why in the world would we be doing something sexual? Come on now. Hey, my sis fiance. Nice to meet you. I'm little sis. That's purified love, said hi. Oh, hold on. My baby girl wants to talk. Well, I mean, no, go ahead. I'm just saying, <laughs> uh-huh. just saying like, I'm going to be doing this real quick. Yeah. So, yeah. Maybe <laughs> you can't even do the noise. Can't do what? You're just doing the, the ling um, sound. Hi. Why is it still so loud? <laughs> Thank you. Happy for you. Happy for y'all. 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 Happy for y'all. Happy for y'all. What's a good y'all? Happy for y'all. Everybody get this. I guess she was on top because she was on YouTube. Probably not. Who? She might have seen the video. Or the live. (laughs) Oh, Oh, shit. Thank you, thank you. Oh, uh, no. Hey, Arena, baby girl, I miss you. Tell your brothers I love them. Um, you know, boys, if y'all see this, Nas, Toa, Hannibal, even little Kobe, I love y'all. Stay cool. Um, hopefully, sometime next month, I'll be able to see you guys. If not, remember I told you. I'm planning so y'all can be with me for the summer, okay? I love y'all. The wedding? Um, we have a date, but we're not talking about it right now. <laughs> Look, if y'all see this about the wedding, when it happens, be there. Whether it's, uh, we're going to be streaming it live, but that's only because, you know, like I said, her family and my family, I mean, whatever. But... <laughs> You know, my immediate circle of family, yeah, y'all can be there. But, uh, yeah, so besides them, besides that, you know what I mean? We're going to be we gonna be streaming it live. So when the wedding happens, everybody going to know about it. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure somebody going to tell it as soon as it happens anyway, so. Yes, but we have the date, though. So. This man poking his head out like... <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's what's up, yeah. <laughs> I think that's what I get with that small ass ring. Yeah, we'll let you know for real. Um, this is not the ring, this is temporary. We'll let you know. Yeah, once again, for whoever wasn't here earlier. <laughs> Reason why she has that ring right now is because I officially have mine, but I <laughs> I was so eager to want to meet this beautiful woman that I rushed out the house making sure I wasn't late for the plane that I left all of her gifts. So, yeah. Mm-hmm. 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 Huh? She probably said, if you don't want to talk, that means she want to talk. <laughs> Could have been. Because that's what she do. And then she'll start trying to figure me out by asking me questions so she can... Nah. <laughs> that's why I send stuff like this. Like, if she don't answer, I'll just send this. I'm not, I'm not about to say it. I'll be fine. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Hey, people. I just want to let y'all know, if y'all got new love and you had old love that involves little lives, um, stay in those little lives' lives, but do the best you can to keep your distance from that old love so that your new love doesn't, you know, feel disrespected or out of place. You know what I'm saying? Because sometimes the old love will try to use kids just to get to you. It hurts. Whether in a good way or a bad way, you know what I'm saying? So, 
Who's going to relocate Sandra? Sandra Brathwaite? Anyway, uh, they, she wants to get out of New York, just like I, I needed to get out of Florida at the time that I met her. I'm not from Florida. I'm from North Philly. But when I met her, I was in Florida. And I had been in Florida 12 years, so I was gone. Last month, I moved to Cali. And didn't think she'd be all right with that, but... She was like, you know what, babe? I'm ready to move. So they gonna be they gonna be coming in to uh moving in with me by the summer when this one finished school. Oh what? When you finish school. Mm -hmm. That's all the time you have right now. Honestly. Oh, that's what's up, son. Yeah, no feeling where it's at. Ha, <laughs> born and raised, brought on me. <laughs> okay. 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 Let me fix that. Let me fix that. Hold up. Hold up. Because you said that so New York. It is not John. It's John. John. Like just John. You know what I'm saying? It's a person, place, now a thing. Like when I talk to my peoples in Philly, you're my main John. I'm the only John. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what you say? She said, I'm your only girl, but anyway. Because I'm the main one. I'm the only one you talk about. You are the only one. That's why you're my main one. But that don't mean I ain't got other joints I got to, like, look out for us. I, I do have a daughter. Right, true. I do have a mom. True. I actually have two daughters. <laughs> true. True. True, true, true. That. True, true. Who the hell did that? That was what's up. Who did that? <laughs> what was it? <laughs> What? Pretty girl roughing. Thank you. She sent the hand heart. Oh, thank you. Anybody else that want to send that again, please, because that shit was cool as hell. <laughs> I thank you for the gifts. I appreciate it. Richard Allen Projects. I ain't think it'd be there anymore. Like. <laughs> I ain't even gonna get into that because that's not a topic to be there. But yeah, I didn't think that was gonna be there too long anyway. Somebody named O dot K said, Oh my god, Janique, I'm happy for you. Thank you. She must know you. Okay. She said your name like she knows you. I can't say <laughs> nothing that's mad small. I can't see. My eyes, are tired. My eyes is tired right now. Yeah, is it still tired? Yeah. Okay, <laughs> I'm still tired. I feel like that was the one on the plane. I'm tired. <laughs> Even better on a plane because you were little. I know. I might go on a plane. Well, I will be going on a plane in April. Mm. I'm not going on a plane. This is too sweet. I'm not going on a plane. You're just going through Zen life. Space, 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 and then he goes, exactly. <laughs> he's like four years old, man. And then he was he like, He should have came to the door with a stick and said, You want to come and play? And he was like, Happy Valentine's Day. And he's like, You're so cute. Valentine's and at the end, at the end, she gave him a Valentine's Day for a four year old, for real. Yeah. I don't think I can't even see that. So Gerard Ave? That's where, you, that's where your people's at? It's been a while since I was in Philly. I ain't even gonna lie. I'm not even trying to front. It's been like since since I was 23, and I'm 36, so it's been a minute. Mm -hmm. I'm just I'm with that video though because it's cute. Cause I forgot what you had in the video. Mm -hmm. No, I'm, I I don't know. I just always had my little naysayers and shit. I don't know. It's a pretty picture. It was a pretty video. It was cute, but oh, it's just like I'm, <laughs> I'm just like, what's the point? Leave what up? 
The, no, the video I posted about going live on Instagram. Oh. What? Someone was blocked. Who was blocked? Thank you for blocking them. I forgot I had moderators on here. Thank you. I didn't see the comments. So I don't know what they said. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, I had moderators on my thing. So people. Have well, y'all already blocked me. Y'all should have let us see it so I can give them the old one, too. <laughs> yeah. Yes, finally. It's not purple. Um, it was supposed to be silver, so I could had a whole silver back look. But <laughs> when I dyed it, I used this blue silver's tint to make it go platinum. So right now it's just blue, but the reason why it looks purple is because it's starting to fade already. Alright, some what? T type nonsense. Thank you for moderating for me, Vicky. Love you. Thank you, sweet. That's my sister right there. I love her. Thank you, thank you. Hey, Angelique, what's up? Oh, what? like, it's for not, the not, evening? Not a I know, but okay. Uh, well, if they actually want to get out, um, so y'all know what I'm into. So we can get the YMCA for all I care. I'm trying to work out. Oh my lord. I might just use her to work out, so that's probably what we're doing. <laughs> oh, Lord, give me a heart attack. Can't do it though, because TikTok will ban us. So I'm scared of heights. And I can't curl it like Walt Tittle. <laughs> <laughs> Not online. Bench press. No, if I bench press, then they're going to say that's something wrong, because she got something in my face. <laughs> but now we're just chilling. I'm tired. I'm going nowhere. You're always tired. I'm always tired. I have no energy. Uh, I had to get used to being able to chill for the whole week. I have to wake up at 3 30 in the morning tomorrow. Thank the Lord. Ow. Imagine your big old head hurt my back. You moved into it. Wait, is that what that was? Because I thought everything just cracked. No, his head is hit my back. My back hurts so bad. Man, why did you move back on my head? Move over. He's got a whole big old bed. Boy, it's fine. I don't want you to spend the night. Need space. Alright. Alright. Queen size not, bed is not good for three people. Unless they're three little people. No, nah, it's not. Unless <laughs> it's like three kids somewhere there. What's there to do in the NY in the cold? Play in the snow? There's no snow, though. And snow. Mm -hmm. That's no right now. No. I mean, it's not like we're going to be outside the whole time. Obviously, we were going to go and do something. We're going to be inside someplace anyway. Doesn't matter if it's cold. I just don't like the cold. So. so I can't wait to move. Somebody said, I am Shonda. Hey, we in. Hi. So happy for you, girl. What? <laughs> <laughs> girl. Girl. That's what she said. Thank I'm you. G-U-R. So happy for you, girl. Girl. Hey, girl. How you doing? Dicky said, hey, Jaden. What's going on? Put your head this way. Bro, this way. What's, What's going on? <laughs> What's going on? How y'all doing? How you doing? What's good, y'all? Hey. Hey, girl, hey. Really? <laughs> really? Really? <laughs> really? Oh, my goodness. Thank you. OMG. Mary, what? 42nd Street? 42nd Street, I mean, it's so crowded over there. What is that? It's like the area in the city is like really like popular. Like, I think it's like near like Red Times Square. Well, you ain't gotta be where everybody else be just to go and do something. That's and plus, eating in Manhattan is really expensive. Like, going to eat in Manhattan? No. We don't have expensive. To do all that. We were actually gonna go to a certain museum. Okay. So, I might be doing that. Maybe we'll see. Maybe yeah, we'll see. <laughs> yeah, but I'll them. You coming to the wedding? Awesome. I'll let you know. <laughs> Why'd you forget? Why'd you forget? I'm not. I'm really going to invite my TikTok people. Honestly. Especially if they live oh, in or near Cali. Can go to. Or can go to Cali. <laughs> or can go to Cali. Because you know. Okay. Not everybody can afford a ticket. Bye, girl. What happened? Nothing. <laughs> I'm just saying. She 
You said biter. No, let's <laughs> say biter. Nobody says that. Angelique, come to the wedding, please. Nobody says We don't have nobody really coming, so we definitely uh, would appreciate that. Nobody said biter. No, you said, you said no, I no. Said. I'm saying the way you said it, like you was calling somebody a biter, like they was like they were trying to copy or something. Oh, no, no, no. I think you're. <laughs> you're. you're yeah, old. see how you say you're? <laughs> That's our Joan. That's what we say. Yeah, in Joan. We Joan. in Philly say Joan. Like y'all be saying, you're. <laughs> well, hey yo, hey yo, hey yo. You sound like a raptor. Durr, durr. <laughs> I <forgot> that. <laughs> it got you. I'll let you know when the wedding is. I'll start talking about it probably like six months before, probably, most likely. We in it's Queens. So I ain't worried about nobody. Uh, I'm 36. I've been out doing this, man. This ain't nothing new to me. Traveling places I don't know. And being the only person I know. I don't I don't fear nothing. I don't fear nobody. We're going to go outside. We're going to have fun. And we're going to do us. And no matter where I go, motherfuckers know not to even try me like that. So we going to go and have fun. And if something pop off, then it pop off because I'm always with the shits. I'm DTF. I am a martial artist, so I'm always down for the action. Always. Oh, you're with names. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you are too, boy. At school, talk about us next week today. Like, oh my god. I make some kid booty whatever. Okay, whatever. But relax. <laughs> don't do it too much. He tried it. Okay, but you don't get suspended or whatever. Oh, dang. My youngest is running a fever. Oh, no. All right. I'm going to do this phone now. Oh, sorry. I guess you have to look at the thing. Talk to you later. Thank you Wait for coming. Yeah, thank you for coming in. Oh, oh Callie, yeah. For the moment, yeah, so far. Queens is not a problem. Just don't let them go to the Bronx. Yeah, the Bronx is like, meh. No. Okay, once again, <laughs> you know, I guess I got to say this again. It doesn't matter. You feel me? Even though I've never been in New York, I'm from the main streets of Philly. North Philly, to be exact. I don't know part of wherever I go worries me. I'm in Cali right now. I live in Los Angeles, in L.A., where everybody talking about, yo, there's a bunch of nutcases over there, bro. Stay safe. That doesn't faze me. Because nobody will ever try me like that. I know they won't. Because all it takes is to just give me a physical motivation. No, it don't matter to him. <laughs> it doesn't matter to him. He is a professional fighter. So that means he's down to fight whenever. He don't care. Hey, Kobe. And he's also a protector. Kobe. I love he you, is buddy. a protector for you sure. Stay strong, like, okay? So, mommy told me you got a feeling. He don't care. He is a professional mixed martial artist. He also boxes. He also personal trains. He also sings, dances, everything. So he is skilled in multiple things. He's always ready to fight. He's down to fight, ready to fight, whenever. So that's just what it is. I can't do nothing about that. Um, he don't need to go there. Whatever. No. <laughs> the, Bronx the thing sucks is, <laughs> the thing is, I don't like the Bronx. The thing is, uh, I'm not really. I'm not. It's not like I'm. I'm trying to go there. Like, I'm not. I'm not one that looks for problems. Never, ever. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, my alias is Big Zen. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm about. Always okay. about peace before anything. But if you bring that action my way and it lets me know that there is no other choice, there's no way to avoid that problem, I'm going to solve it real, real quick. I'm gonna on the ASAP. I don't go to the Bronx. Um, I'm in Queens. And at the same time, you're right. A lot of niggas don't want to fight no more. But I never said that I, all I can do is just fight. 
I've been doing this since I was two years old. I am a professor of the savage science in every way, artillery, melee, any type of weapon in my hand is a weapon. I can literally kill you with this. <laughs> Yeah, I live in Queens, New York, but um, I don't really like the Bronx that much. I prefer Queens or Brooklyn or Manhattan's cool, but it's too crowded. And people think Manhattan is so great because of the sightseeing, but it's way too crowded. And yeah, I'm glad I live in Queens. Mostly. Like, Queens is better. Sorry. <laughs> and Brooklyn. Brooklyn's cool too. I like Brooklyn. You said Bronx. Did he say, he said. But Bronx is busted up. <laughs> Bronx is ghetto as hell. <coughs> it's like, uh, what? I can't see that. So true love does exist. I'm happy for you. Oh, thank you. She said, "I live in the in the Bronx. So I don't want to be here." <laughs> I mean, it's not the best place in New York. That's for sure. My sister and her new husband live in the Bronx. She's gonna be my husband. That's why everybody keep talking about the wedding. The wedding. <laughs> you keep saying certain shit. I said That's her, my sister and her husband no. live in the Bronx. Right? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> okay, because I don't feel like saying fiance. I like the word. I don't feel like saying fiance. I like the husband. You were so hyped to say that at one time. Now I think this is my husband. I like that better. The what? I like saying that's my husband better. I like I'll hear my way. back. He's still with the shit. <laughs> Literally been saying all day your back is hurting. Uh, I can say this is my husband. Then, well, I mean, I can say this is my husband, my fiance, but I like husband. So. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that noise! So you. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> What you say? Not bad. <laughs> Watch your friend. Yeah. Mm. Uh, the video where you guys finally saw each other. Oh, my coat. Thank you. I got that to match him. The what? She said, I love your coat, Michael. So I'll say. <laughs> she was Michael. 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 That was to match him, so. Of course. Oh. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, I like husband. See, I like husband better too. I don't like saying my fiance. He's my husband. It's gonna happen, so why not? Um, yeah, our kids will meet each other probably by um, July. Probably by July. That what now? She said, are you excited to have your kids meet each other? Oh, I've been trying to make that. Probably by July. It's definite. Because we'll be moving like right at the end. We'll be moving like right at the end of June. That basically means my oldest got an older brother now. Andy. Hopefully like around July, they'll get to me and chill and play. And they can all jump on their new big brother. Excuse me? (laughs) Yeah, yeah, be ready for that, bro. Be ready for yeah, fiance is not a word. Husband is the move. Facts. Husband all day. Oh my God, y'all so extra. <laughs> Jesus, all the fiance just means is just like when you went to high school and you had a oh y'all going steady. It's the same shit. It just means I'm I'm saying that sooner or later we gonna be bonded permanently. That's all. That's my cousin there. I just say I'm not your husband yet because of the criterias of the system and the law and the legalities. <laughs> Ooh, what? Set what? I mean, you was already my wife when I told Set you I loved you the first time. So I don't okay. even know what that just said. I missed that. How do you feel to your son? Oh my gosh, when I see my um son and, and Zen like talk, I'm like, ugh, I love it. Yeah, that's my boy. I love it. It makes me want to cry. They're so cute together. And they both born in May. So. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Hell yeah, May time is play time. <laughs> they, all, they have a lot in common already. And yeah, so it's cool. I love it. Makes me really happy. Yeah, you told me that before, mate. She already trying to match us. 
<laughs> my two main men. T M M. He's a Taurus. Yeah, my son's a Taurus. Mm -hmm. He's a Gemini. I'm a Gemini. My son is the bull. We're all bull. No, he's no. you're the bull. No, we're all born in year the ox. Yeah, the ox. But, but you're a bull. He was almost a Gemini, but he was early. So it's all good. I don't need to have it's three, all good. two other Geminis. That'd be kind of crazy. Gemini son, Gemini mm -hmm. husband. Uh, why is my back hurting? Uh, <laughs> 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 um, I can't. <laughs> I can't talk about that on TikTok. If I talk about that, I'll get banned again. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just to say he's really strong, so I can say. Um, he understood the assignment, definitely. Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. Um, 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 what? Not in front of you, a baby. <laughs> he's not even a baby. He's almost, I am 12 years he's old. almost 13. <laughs> he's, he's almost oh, 13. You don't mind and my son knows about sex, so that's all good. Oh, yeah, they banned me earlier, yeah. Was that the flash? I don't know, it's an ad. Um, but yeah. Oh, okay. Can't talk about my, my, my back hurts right now. But Yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> I mean, yes, he's always going to be my baby, but he's almost a teenager. Indeed. Mind your business. If you know, you know. <laughs> True. If you know, you know. I mean, Bro, we haven't seen like each that? other. <laughs> we just not met. So, so yeah. His physics are horrible. Well, you know why? Why? Because look at the dynamics, man. I said it to be funny. I'm sure we all know, of course. I'm sure we all know. Oh, my back hurts because of you. <laughs> what? It we don't keep going. <laughs> yeah, like, okay. it just ends up anyway. That's women for you, man. That's women. Uh, yes, I do want to start a business as a decorator or really more a party planner or event planner. So when I do move oh, to yeah, Cali, when I move to Cali, I do want to do that. I'm definitely gonna use my wedding as a way to like showcase what I can do. So you're gonna showcase my wedding. Yeah, basically, because it's gonna be better than the way I did my sister's. So. <laughs> see, see, we just talked about that last night. You know, we had that issue with your mom, man. Y'all gotta Back. stop doing that with each other. Um, thank you, Vicky. <laughs> I'm just saying, when I plan my wedding, it's gonna be extravagant. Way better than the way I did my sister's because it's about us and like finding true love. So and like. <laughs> so like I'm not trying to be like petty but just like who's saying like like cause you know like <laughs> <laughs> oh. sorry but yeah <laughs> mm, be yeah like. definitely better weather in Cali um so yeah I'm excited I've lived here my whole life so it's been really boring <laughs> It is boring, Jaden. You have fun because you have your little peoples. Yeah. I'm excited. It's a long way away, but it's fine. Like, the distance, the travel. Uh, yeah, definitely outside wedding, for sure. Outside. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. 
Um, summer wedding, yes. Not this summer, though. Um, basically, for everybody in here that's Gemini, we basically going to have a Gemini wedding. <laughs> so, we're, you know, it's going to be it's going to be set between both of our birthdays. So it's kind of like a gift to both of us to make this happen. So. New York. Yeah, New York got boring. Yeah, New York is kind of uh, like people think it's so great, but it's really not. That's because of how it used to be. Everybody gave up on that. Yeah, New York is like, I mean, yeah, we have great places to like go and visit, yeah. but it's not that great. And the police here, the worst. Like, I get scared every time I get pulled over. That's why I was trying to tell you in Cali, you got nothing to worry about that. Because in Cali, weed is legal. So a lot of them cops over there, all they care about is the big time, like criminals and dead people. I mean, getting pulled over like for like that. stopping a stop sign, nah, running a stop sign, or whatever. No, nah, I'm telling you, that's what I'm saying. Like over in Cali, I seen people run red lights like crazy, and them cops will look at it like I'm not, I'm not writing that report. Like they ain't trying to do all that for that. Because I literally, that's like <laughs> that's all care. I got was running a stop sign or running a red light. No, mostly running a stop sign. Mostly, I've got that like three times. Um, but yeah. Uh, what does that say? Are you much? Uh, he so, is both traditional and not. <laughs> I mix. But he's an entrepreneur. Yes, he is. I mix it up. I mix it up. Um, I'm not getting into all that because I don't like to tell my business too much. I like results to be the answer. So. Basically, in Cali, I will be opening up my own dojo and starting my own new uh, fitness program. Um, it's going to be something like Fight Fitness on Delivery. It's going to be a little mixture of old school Taibo type kickboxing aerobics mixed with new school cross fitness that combines actual traditional drills from martial art styles that I know. So, yeah, that's what I've been working on in Cali right now. The wedding is next year. Y'all with this wedding. Like, we just <laughs> met. You don't give up. Do y'all not understand? The video of us meeting at the airport was the first time we met. And five months before that, we just knew each other on the phone. So, like, I don't know why people in this day and age want to rush life so fast and they want to grow old so quick. Like, we're going to get married. It's a, it's a fact. But it's just not, like, tomorrow or some shit. Like... <laughs> We want. I want to. I want a whole year of getting to know my family before I make something new with her. You know what I mean? I like to get to know her first. Feel free that we just enjoying each other and being with each other, being around each other. Get a whole year to set up our foundation, build our home, build up everything we need for the rest of the family to come in. Cause it's definitely about to grow. <laughs> yeah, you already got six. Zen, are you more traditional and prefer your wife to stay home or do you support her being an entrepreneur? I do both. I do both. So, um, I've always been the type where it's like if I meet a woman and it's starting to feel like chemistry is real, my first thing is I ask her, what do you want out of this? Because I'm with whatever. I'm a Gemini, so I'm with it all. But if, you know, if she wants to be the type that want to stay home and be around the kids so we ain't got to leave our kids with everybody else, that's fine. That means I understand the assignment. That means I need to uh, go out there and do what I got to do so she can be able to be safe at home and not, I ain't got to worry about nobody, you know what I mean? I ain't got, <laughs> point is, I ain't got to go psycho against the world, you know what I mean? But, um, you know, but if she wants to, like, you know, I want to work too or I want to do my own thing or I'm trying to be out there that, that's cool with me. I'm, I'm fine with that as long as she's safe. You know what I'm saying? If you're going to be out there in the world without me, don't be don't be soft. You already know me. Don't be soft. Don't ever let nobody get the best of you when I'm not around. <laughs> so happy for you guys. Thank you, Britt. Thank you, Delicate Amor. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Mm. Hoping no one asks 
question anymore. Don't ask that question. I'm yeah, y'all with this <laughs> wedding question, look, this is one thing to say when it comes to trying to rush what we doing. V pour les jours, which means live the day. <laughs> Thank you. Britt, do you live in Cali? I think you do, right? I think, pretty sure. Because if you live in Cali, I need to see you in June or July. Or April. <laughs> yeah, but Cali is like a whole country of its own. Like, uh, where in <laughs> Cali do you live, Britt? Like, LA is like a state by itself. Wait, can't see. Um, hey, you keep bumping that over. Like, you know, <laughs> <laughs> oh, Sacramento? Okay. Where I'm going to go wherever he chooses to live. Wherever he chooses to move in Cali. So I don't know where. Whatever he goes, I don't know. So... I mean, because of my line of work that I'm trying to get into in the field of uh, filming and uh, stuntman and fight choreograph and stuff like that and action movies, I'm pretty much staying around where, you know, the film studios is all like that. So I'm going to do what I can to uh, build our foundation, you know, close to like L.A. or Hollywood. All right, you're in Sacramento, so we definitely have to like, because I really don't have, I only have like two friends in Cali. So, yeah, definitely, um, okay, Jim, definitely need to see you, because we've been friends for a minute on TikTok for, like, over a year, so, can't wait to see you, Brit. I'll be in LA in April, spring break, I'll be visiting him. Before the move, and then I'm out of here. Thank the Lord Jesus. Um, you'll be in New York. Ah, oh, what are you doing in New York, Nikki? I mean, Jem, so I can't see. Lady Jem, what are you doing in New York? Oh, wait, I forgot you said you have your... Dentist out here? One thing? I forgot what you said before. Because um, you're a Miss Traveler. <laughs> she travels a lot. Because she works without the window shower. Who is. What? Who he texting? Nobody. <laughs> no, I'm not texting. I'm checking my feed. I don't do that. Relax. Relax. <laughs> Hi, Mr. Cherokee, how are you? Let me go to your friend, Mr. Cherokee. He said this. Yo, <laughs> I was just about to look for you, bro. That's what's up. Peace. <laughs> That's literally why I was on here anyway. I'm trying to find you. Thank you. Uh, what? I'm over here smiling from ear to ear. <laughs> Thank you. I love you and your wife's connection as well. Like you guys are so awesome. Huh? My new favorite couple. Who said that? No, I'm saying I'm telling him I like him as him as. Oh, Mr. Chick. Yeah, yo. I I ain't even gonna lie. Um, I had a point where I didn't think this was even gonna go this far with her, but when I saw y'all, like. Don't take it no type of way, but I knew, I think I knew your wife first because she followed my page and then like I started seeing yours page because she posted something about you after I think she seen something we did and then she posted something about you while you were working out. It looked like it was in a sauna. So, um, like, yeah, bro, y'all, y'all, um, Y'all pretty much, y'all pretty much my new favorite couple because I wasn't even, <laughs> I wasn't even about all that on TikTok. I didn't even care. Like I, I stay in my own business, but I like how y'all been doing, like for real. Ah, yeah. oh, thank you. See, that's the thank you, thank you. Who that? Reese Cup. Yes, thank you. That's I've been waiting for somebody to understand that. Like, thank you. 
<laughs> Appreciate that, Mr. Cherokee. Uh, I don't really know what a true love story really is. You know what I'm saying? I've, I've, I've seen them growing up. I've heard about them. I've watched them on movies. So if that's what we live in right now, <laughs> I appreciate it. I guess we on cloud nine because I don't know what to really call this. Um, we're not married. We're engaged. But thank you. <laughs> no. Nah, nah. Playing together. Same but, room. Same you place. You know, we we not married yet, but that's just with legal legalities. You know what I'm saying? But <laughs> when I got to deal with women on the street, no, I'm married. <laughs> He is one. Oh, he's big happy. Hell yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> That's all my life. Oh. Yes, he's big happy. I'm big happy. Yeah, so we're not married yet, but engaged, fine together, same zip code, same time zone. Basically. <laughs> Don't worry about the time difference. It's like, okay, because I know certain people all with this traditional crap and all this shit. One thing traditional about me is I'm not going to marry a woman and then have her live completely across the country from me and I don't know that she's safe. Like, I can't do that. I can't be married to her, fully married, but she don't make sure, but I can't make sure her ass is in my bed at night. I can't do that. So we working on that. Three more months, thank the Lord. Time's going fast, I love it. I've been here from, yeah. I've been here from before we found each other. I'm so happy. Lady La Rose said you deserve this. Hell yeah, we'll be there. Brooklyn Shauna said when she plays, hey, hello, 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 this is your live, this is your live. Brooklyn Shauna, Brooklyn Shauna said when I play my wedding, I need y'all there, so definitely. Hey, you know what? I'll sing at the wedding, for real. I'll, um, I'll sing the Jamie Foxx song that he did on the show. Thank you, Lady Jim. When are you getting married? Thank you, Miss Lady Jim. Is it a June wedding? July. Brooklyn's getting married this year. I know, I said when? Oh, not Atlanta is popping. For black people and the game it is. Less expensive? Less expensive. I don't know. Um, I go wherever he goes, so I don't care. I follow him wherever he goes. <laughs> I mean, I've never really been in Georgia. For one, and my ex-wife's whole entire existence is from Georgia, so yeah, um, it's not that we wouldn't do it. It's just it ain't like I'm too fond of being somewhere where she comes from. You know what I mean? When I was married to her, I didn't even go to Georgia because I just I knew how she was with her family, and she wasn't about to play me in front of them when I'm like left out like sitting up. So I don't really know about Georgia like that. But it don't matter to me. Wherever he lives, I'm living. I don't even care. Yeah, Cali is expensive, but the 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 minimum wage there went up. You know what I'm saying? So, especially that, like, in Cali, like, I've noticed when I was there, like, a lot of people have been doing a lot of, like, entrepreneur, self-employed type of things while they go and work somewhere. So, <laughs> something being expensive ain't really a big deal. You know what I'm saying? New York expensive is expensive. New York is expensive. Philly is expensive. Florida was expensive when I was there. It just depends on where you go in Florida. Mm, wait, you got that. You in the middle. Because <laughs> the messages was stuck. Somebody said, I'm in ATL. Oh, Miss Lady Jim's in ATL right now. Oh, yeah, that's so where she live at. I don't know. She lived there. I'm coming over here. <sighs> that girl, um, Mo Davis? That girl, Mo Davis? Oh, that's my friend. She says, I know you heading out of, you know, you coming over to camp. Yes, yes. That's that's pretty much where I live. So she says she's willing to uh, relocate once I, uh, once he gets out of school, she's going to relocate over there. Mm -hmm. 
Cali. You're in Cali too? Yeah, I have more than one friend there. Awesome. Yay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, 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 Miss uh, Gemini, nineteen seventy five. Yeah. Florida is definitely expensive, Everyone's but expensive. like I said, it, it depends on where in Florida though, because it wasn't as bad where I was staying at. But before I left Florida, it wasn't that bad. It was, um, yeah, it wasn't that expensive. I was in Sanford, Florida. It wasn't, it wasn't that expensive over there. It's expensive wherever it's popular. At. I lived there for five years. Yeah, I was there for 12 since 2012. I ain't trying to go back. Wait, oh, West Palm Beach in Orlando? All right. Orlando is kind of where I'm stationed at when it comes to, like, my connections and my people. But my real connection like that, when I was in the fight world, uh, my fight club and my teammates, they all from... uh, uh, Hollandale or Broward County, Hollandale, which is like right next to Hollywood, Florida. And my kids, uh, my three oldest were born in Hollywood, so. Um, do we want a big wedding? Mm, don't know yet. Mm, probably not. I mean, see, they would go again about the whole money thing. Like, everybody's so worried about spending this and spending that. The fact is, the the... The whole point of it is to just express our communion, to showcase our bond. So some big wedding when we don't really have people that, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't care for a lot of people, you know what I'm saying? Like, I keep I keep my circle real tight and strong because everybody being there doesn't make it a great thing. You know what I'm saying? Too many people being there doesn't mean, oh, man, it's so lit because you got all these people. That don't mean shit because if all those people start drama or cause toxic energy, then they don't need to be there. You know what I mean? So a big wedding, small wedding, I mean, that depends on how you look at it. That's a Gemini in you. That's what she said. That's what she said about me? I guess. I guess. I guess. back. Uh, Miss Lady Jim, you said that's the Gemini in me. If you talk about me, I don't know what you mean by that. I don't know because I just speak my heart, so I have no idea what I said that made you say that. Oh yeah, yeah, keeping the circle small. Yeah, yeah. Because you know, like Gemini's, we ain't afraid to be out there. We, you know, we high spirited. You know what I mean? We always positive, but. Because of our energy, a lot of people don't know how to respect that because they don't know how to be happy in life. So that's why I keep the circle small. But at the same time, I ain't never like ill-mannered. I don't, I don't do all that holding grudges, none of that. I don't, I don't judge nobody. I just don't really care for all the, all the, all the shenanigans. Okay, go back. They don't spill us back into it. Yeah, I feel you, Brooklyn. And in terms of how would it work for a family, he's a huge family man, so it'll work out no matter how many kids we have together. It doesn't matter. We already have six together, so, I mean. Exactly, like, why would that be? <laughs> doesn't really matter. I, did, I mean, y'all definitely heard that I have kids, and I was married eight years before I met her. And I met her, like, two, three months after... Um, I got divorced, separated, so. His per- that's supposed to be blue on his beard because my favorite color is blue, his favorite color is green. That's why we have the hair colors the way that we do. Um, yeah. But yeah. <laughs> yeah. Even on this, you got so, that name? So his beard is <laughs> supposed to be blue. Oh, wait, no, this is in the name. Yeah, and that's supposed to be me. <laughs> yeah. That's awesome, Brooklyn. Definitely. Hair. So yeah, he sings. <laughs> He's an amazing yeah, singer. Yeah, no so he like will definitely sing at your wedding. Oh. That's my His song. voice is awesome. Yep. That, that's my style. I definitely be wearing it. If you invite us to your wedding, we'll invite you to our wedding. Not Brooklyn, the one that you sing at a wedding. You said November, December. J. Bell, the divorce. 
Divorce will be final when I get back home and I make things happen with the court on my own terms because, you know, some people when you, some people in a, in, a, in, a, in a marriage tend to understand and just, you know, learn how to let go of the past. And others, well, they make excuses why we can't just go ahead and get this over with. You know what I'm saying? So... While that's happening in Florida, I'm just not even gonna worry about it. I found out something in Cali that I can do on my own. So it'll be, the divorce will be final. I estimate and manifest in about the next month or two, it'll be final. Uh, I definitely send you an invite, Jim. I got you. What? Lady Jim wants an invite to the wedding. Okay, I'm going to say this again. <laughs> I'm going to say this again. We don't have immediate family. You know what I'm saying? Like, my dad's side of the family, my mom's side of the family, my dad's side of the family, they all up in Philly. And they so bougie and doing their own thing. I don't even think they even know what's going on with me. So, whatever. My mom's side of the family, I mean, they can kick rocks. You know what I'm saying? Like, the whole time in Florida, because that's where my mom is from, the whole time in Florida when I was married and had all those kids, not one bit of my family came to see them. So they can, you know what I'm saying? Anybody, basically what I'm getting in, getting at is any of y'all that actually care and y'all real about this woman, come to the wedding and see how happy I make her. It's going to be a TikTok wedding. I mean, it's a TikTok love story, so. Basically. <laughs> I'm not going through a divorce. The fact is... To be honest, last year, trying to make it work with, with with the other one, we went through something very drastic that I would never wish on anybody's family. I would never wish on any man to go through what I had to go through, and I'm just, I'm blessed that I'm still here to survive through it, mm-hmm. and that my kids are still able to know me. So, with that being said, I'm not going through a divorce, it's just more of, she left me. She act like she was done and didn't want to try anymore, and I've been by her side eight years straight, delivered every baby myself, natural birth, caught every single child myself and I named them. Watched them take their first steps, watched them take their first breath, watched them take uh, their first walk. I watched every single one of them take their first crawl. I've seen every single one of them take their first time standing up, first time saying a word, but she didn't want that. She didn't want that no more. So after the depression, I met someone that made me realize I deserve more than what I was giving up. So, after that happened, me and her became what we are. And it just kind of was that, you know what I'm saying? So, with the divorce, it's just more of trying to get her in Florida to pursue that and make that, you know, as quick as possible. But she wants to put it all on, like, she has to sign the papers And I'm just supposed to uh, check my name off to agree to it or whatever, but I'm not waiting on that. that. Dina says, so you think you're ready to get married again? That I'm getting, that I'm ready to get married again. First and foremost, marriage is is an illusion. So that whole like what y'all mean by getting married and doing that whole thing again? No, that's not gonna happen. But getting married as in like her becoming my, my wife, my woman, my queen, yeah, I'm ready for that. What real man is not going to say that at a certain age, especially after he doesn't experience being a family man, that he doesn't still want to be that? That's who I am. I'm, I'm, I, I've never been that, oh, now I'm single. I'm, I'm going to be out here, this, that, and the third. I'm holding it up. Like, no, that's not me. I got too many kids out here to be worried about trying to get y'all to like me for this and this, that, and the third. Like, if that was the case, I'd have never, I would have never even tried to with this one. You know what I'm saying? Like, y'all asking me a question that's kind of like its own answer because I met her. I found her. I hit her up. And I was the one that told her for the first, um, the, I was the first one that told her I loved her. You know what I'm saying? Not to mention, I was the one that made the video singing to her and then afterwards I proposed to her. So yes, I'm pretty sure I'm, I'm, I'm ready. <laughs> The difference between y'all ideal of marriage and mine's 
is basically what I just put out there. So, um, if you didn't hear me, I guess basically what I'm saying is the difference is the difference that I'm getting at is this whole like systematic illusion that we gotta have some church wedding, this big pizzazz, or this, that, and the third. It's gotta be like this. You gotta do it this way traditionally, and this, that. And th I don't do that. I don't do that. I'm a rebel. I do my way. If it feels right for me, I do it. If she's cool with it, then we do it that way. But we do our wedding, however we compromise and work at it. And if she agrees with me about it, that's what we're going to do. If she doesn't agree with me, we keep going until we find a compromising decision. That's it. Wait, what? Single doesn't mean that you can take time to work on yourself, but okay. Uh, okay. Actually, that's what being single is. Because, uh, like I said, by, by the time I met her, I was single for about two months. That's all I needed. That's all I needed. You know why? Because, like I said, I'm a family man. I'm a man of, of, of the people when it comes to immediate people that revolve around my circle and when I feel like I can be there for you I'll be there for you so to me I'm just a family man it doesn't matter if we're related it doesn't matter if you're in a relationship with me if we know each other and I call you my family I'm going to do what I can for you I don't know what that means but okay <laughs> That's just a party. So about the way it is. Oh, the way to... Okay, well, see, that's what I'm saying. So that means you see it my way, too. Like, those type of weddings, that's just trying to party and all that. Okay. You know what I'm saying? That's the difference. Um, that whole, like, y'all want a big wedding, a loud wedding and all that, it's like, we want a garden wedding. I'll just say it like that. We want a garden wedding. Um, my mom, back when I was a kid, and she married my stepdad, when she married my stepdad, um, they got married in the house that we moved into. When they got their first house together, that's where they got married, was in the living room. And they christened the house that way. I always thought that was beautiful. So, uh, since y'all need to know so bad, <laughs> our wedding will be like the property that we get that becomes our home and all that. We're going to get married in the garden. I'm going to make sure I give her that great garden that she was talking about so we can get married in it and I can see her walk down the aisle. Well, nah, as you know me, I'm not that traditional. I'm not about to stand there and wait for you to walk to me. If anything, you stand there, I'll walk to you. All right, so, because they keep with these questions. So, baby, what do you want? What do you want? I'm not even going to talk to What do you want? <laughs> what is the question? <laughs> I want to be with him. Marriage, kids. Because somebody, Robin Cole, told me she want a big wedding. She said that. I, I never said that. When she talked to me, she never mentioned no big wedding. She Small told me medium. everything I mentioned about the whole garden and everything, that was her idea, not mine. It just shocked me that she said that because that's what I grew up on with seeing my uh, mom. But that wasn't my idea. That was hers. I just don't care for no big ass wedding because I don't care for a lot of people that I know for a fact are fake. Should I? No, I've never said Hey, Jaden. Like medium. Somebody's asking, how do you feel about me? I'm going to let you talk that one. Oh. Come on. Come on. Well, so far, I love him very much. He's a very kind man. He's a great father. He makes mommy happy. I don't know about that. Um... Yeah, I'm very happy. He's really nice to me. He he's makes me feel good. He makes mommy feel good. Um, when she's happy, I'm happy. He's great. And um, I, me and him, when we uh, when we are gone and we're moving, and currently we're gonna be good friends, a good fr great family. And yeah, he's great. You're gonna be my son, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> so yeah, what I want is marriage, <laughs> babies. Um. To help him run his business, businesses, um, everything. I am down for everything, anything. I will go wherever he lives, wherever he moves, I will move. 
I'm in love with him, so that's just what it is. Um, I can hear the kids. It's my kid. It's my son. Hmm? Now someone commented in the video. I can hear the kids. What is she talking about? Like, I have one kid in the video. It was probably just kids in the background. Oh. <laughs> yeah, a little bit cold. <laughs> Got that cold because of you. It's like, yeah. I mean, no, people were saying about the coat. They love the coat. Um, but, <laughs> um, 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 that's, that's what I feel. If she's happy, you're happy. And then lay in the house and try two Maseratis. I don't want a Maserati or a mansion. I'm good. <laughs> It's a regular house. I don't need all that. I'm a basic, not basic, but like not natural. Natural. I'm not into all that bougie <laughs> shit. Or that hoity twitty. Right. All that does is make humans weak. I don't need a mansion. I don't need no Maserati or no Tesla or none of that. Like Maserati. regular car is fine. You sure you don't want no Tesla? Mm, no. Maybe I don't know. I don't know. It's an electric car. Yeah. I'm great on the on the um, ozone. I guess. In the economy. What does it matter? I'll take whatever I can get. <laughs> so, yeah. Simplicity is the best thing. Yes. I'm reading his comments on the video. He said he didn't want to let you go. <laughs> the what? He said he didn't want to let you go. Somewhere. No, absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. I went through too much to finally see you. There was no way I was going to hug you real quick and just let you go. Got me all the way messed up. <laughs> Oh, this is rich and now that's nice. Take care of my brother. J-Belt. Yeah, I get it. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. Real rich people don't spend money. They invest. Mm. Because too many comments. That's all you can do. I like, that's what I'm saying. I'm happy for you. Thank you. Uh, Nathalie? 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 What the fuck? She's always putting acting like it's on that fucking hinge. I know that. I didn't know why I said her name. I was going to tell her thank you. But, uh... <laughs> yeah. Wait, what? I'm so happy. What? What? Where? Sorry, we couldn't. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy this ended well for you. Thank you. Look at that. Look at him walking <laughs> to you like he just came off of a GQ photo shoot. So happy. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least somebody liked how I looked. I love how he looked. Man. Connection. I can feel it from Kenya. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to stick that guy, buddy. Already. Like, wait, that's what I did. Oh yeah, my Kenya friend, uh, Mapindo. If you, if you get to this live, or if you find this live, or somebody know you, somebody mention her, just please somebody let her know we we on here right now. Like, Always some do? dudes just trying. You know, it's just he trying too hard not to like just be happy for the situation. He want to be miserable, so he got to say some shit to try to blow up. Like you thinking he gonna not, whatever. That <laughs> shit is all over. Yo, it's, I swear, TikTok, you got some thirsty ass dudes on here for real. 
I wasn't even thirsty. I had never been thirsty. I just made my posts, did my thing, met a few women here and there, and then she just she just took the cake. <laughs> Thank you. Can I what? Okay, Ashley, Alexa. Um, yeah, I, I can tell you knew. You don't know nothing about it, but um. So. So how we met was um. Like I said, real quick, long story short, I was on TikTok after being depressed of a separated situation with my ex-wife. I seen, I went on TikTok to just try to, you know, check my feed and all that, and I seen her page, and when I seen her page, it was just the way the video was, uh, came off and the way her energy was in it that just said, you know what, I got to let her know I exist. Mm -hmm. Long story short, uh, two months later, for the first time, I told her I loved her, and the rest of the story is what it is now. Lady Jam, Nikki, if you're in here, put a comment so I can see your name, please. Nikki Dago. Uh, can I have neck problems? I keep it weak. Knuckle texting. Right there. I got you. There you go. Sorry, I forgot to make a moderator before. I haven't been live in so long, so it's like, yeah. Um. <laughs> uh. Good for you for shooting your shot. Yeah, he did. <laughs> he did. Which is crazy. But it happened. Um, yeah, definitely a lot of thirsty guys on here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Mm-mm-mm. Speaking of that, with the thirsty guys, y'all continue to comment her stuff. That shit don't faze me. And I trust her. I know her. You know what I'm saying? So, y'all try to inbox her. That don't faze me. You know what I'm saying? I'm a man of my own. I'm comfortable with mine. You know what I'm saying? I got too much to offer for me to be worried about y'all niggas. So, y'all want to sit there and try to sabotage a beautiful union because y'all can't be happy with y'all selves. That karma gonna hit like a motherfucker. Let me tell you that. Yeah, I pushed the black button. I fast. Yep, it's that easy. I don't even say anything. Just black. I'm not about to lose him for nobody. Sorry. It's just as easy as walking by somebody like they don't exist. Especially after what I went through last year. No. I'm good. So good. No more TikTok crushes. No more chasing after people. None of that. Nah, I chased you. <laughs> I am tired of being like the way I was last year. It was ridiculous. So. Appreciate that. You right, though, Lady Jim. You damn right. That's definitely facts. Like, Literally, as soon as she started hyping me up and then focused on me, now all of a sudden they want to be all about her now. <laughs> anyway. And yeah, like, Jim, you know, like for real, last year was crazy. Like, so that's why I stopped going to people's lives and unfollow some people and stuff like that because, sorry, I'm not about to mess this up, so I do what I have to do. If you don't see me in someone's live, it's for a reason. Uh, Ashley is asking you if you ever okay. Ashley is asking you if you ever go through depression as well. No, not really. Or did you? Did you? Basically when we met each other. Did you go through it too? No. Um... Just no, we tried, uh, J Bell. We tried, um, we tried the, the Airbnb thing, but um, it just wasn't, it wasn't going right. Um, this was pretty much the perfect fit because she's right down the street from my house, so 
it's not like we had to get away, like, all the way away like that, you know what I mean? She's still right there, so it's not bad. She's actually closer to her home. Thank you, Kadeen. Is that, I can't even see. Yeah, Kadeen. Thank you. Yes, I'm she tired, does. but... Um, yes, she does. You know why she looks beautiful? Because every day I made sure she stopped putting herself down. <laughs> I'm super tired, but thank you. Miss Lady J yeah. Yep, see? Because you know, Gemini's got to. We have to, man. Too many people... Uh, too many people capitalize on our energy and the way we... Like, the type of like vibe we bring into the world. So... When people feel that from us, the first thing they do is want to take advantage of that shit. Don't even know how to appreciate us and respect us as Gemini's, you know what I'm saying? So, Lady Jim, you're right about that. I definitely cut a lot of people off. Yes, we finally met each other after four and a half months. Thank you, Kadeen. Thank you. <laughs> For Oh, okay, twin. Uh, my my bad, twin. Yeah, that's my other Gemini's. Is that another? <laughs> I have to change it. Hell no, you gave it a gig. Yeah. What? 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 What's that? <laughs> oh, you know what that is, right? What? Oh, this That's this how, is a size on X, I think. So you mess with you? This is a size one X, and this is what it looks like. Hey, so hey. yeah. <laughs> Sorry. You're showing too much. <laughs> no, because she's asking about the outfit, so. It's a 1X, and it's from Sheen. Sheen, Shine, however you say that name. S-H-E-I-N. It's a 1X, I think. Um, Sheen curve. So, yeah, the waistband is good. You can, if you can, I'm just saying. If you can't keep it black, I don't want it to look like you got a whole new video. Thank you. I know this outfit is really cute. Like, I love it. It's so cute. It has like this really cool thing on the side, like this split on the side. It's really cute. Thank you. I was trying to pick yeah. out. <laughs> I was trying to pick out comfortable yeah. outfits. So. Yeah. You know, yeah. You wanna, is he able to wear a headband? And then the pants look like they're tight. Actually, kind of oh. saw on me. If that's the only one, then yeah, you can keep that. Oh, cool. But, right. but yeah, I tried to bring comfy stuff to the hotel. A little dark. Yeah, right here. Right comfy right. and. Hell yeah. Cute. <laughs> <laughs> you know you gotta get the ankle wraps. Oh, yeah. Yeah, definitely comfy. I love being comfortable. Like, I love wearing comfortable clothes. Man, I look like a seafood for real. I barely ever wear, I barely ever wear heels. And I barely ever wear dresses. So they do have the blue shoes, oh. shoes I saw. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. keep doing that. No, my mom is at home. My mom is home. Oh, I'm like, not my son is here at my mom's home. Actually, no, my mom went to the Bronx. <laughs> no, but yeah, my mom's not here. My son's here, yes. Hmm? No, because they were saying if my mom is here. No, my son is here. <laughs> I know. He's, he's sitting here making me. He's creating me right now. <laughs> is your mom... That's just a pass. Is she coming around? Uh, slowly but surely. Yeah. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> slowly but surely, yes. Nah, that's... They make me look like I'm old. <laughs> what? Who's that? Like, it's like your... Um, you want to change it? Why? Yeah. Would that um, do that? That didn't make any sense. It's not that I don't want to talk about her. I just. Oh, you whatever. had shin bars on me. Thank you. Me? I think. Yeah. You had shin bars on me. That's right. That's right. I'm trying to get back to one color. There you go. Basically, my family is in this room right now. So, like, yes, my mother is in my life. Oh, yeah. I love my mother, but my family is literally these two people behind me. So, 
Yes, I love Actually, my mother. I don't hate my mother. The shoulders but you know, just my family it, literally consists of these two people the, uh, and out. his kids, who are my kids now. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. Uh, tattoo on your arm or like mm. where? Yeah, like that's fine. Right. That's fine. That's the only one? Um, uh, so then you can't pass that. You don't need so. So, whatever it does, you can't pass that. Yeah, that one's bad. Oh, this one? No. Yeah. Um, I mean, yes, your family, but I'm saying, like, my family in terms of, like, um, immediate family, like, that's around me is these two right here. But, yes, Jim, Nikki, you're definitely family for sure. Oh, this must be a signature move. For sure. Oh, my gosh. Mm. But yeah, like I said, me and my mom are working on our relationship, but my family is right here. Um, so, <laughs> what? No, I don't care. No. <laughs> I'm like, well, I ain't look that big in the morning last time. No, because that's the, that's the, um, this thing called the muscle over here. Like, the bills. Like Thank you. Thank you. Oh, the belt tone. No. <laughs> Thank Why you. Why are you so close to the camera, Mom? Because I can't, uh, I can't read the comments. Yeah. And I'm, like, blind right now. Um, no, my son is just chilling for the day. He's going to go back home. He's not staying in the hotel. He go back to his own bed at home. They're just chilling. They're just having their <laughs> father and son time right now. So, yeah. Oh, <laughs> Jaden, is Chase the Bag your friend? Chase the Bag 2.0? He said Jaden is playing Wrestling Revolution. Wait, let me see. <laughs> is this your friend? Jaden, is Chase the Bag your friend? Chase the Bag 2.0? He said Jaden is playing Wrestling Revolution. Wait, let me see. <laughs> is this your friend? Come on the side. Can you see him? Rajay! Oh, that's Rajay. Who's good, Rajay? <laughs> that's his name? Yes. Rajay? Yep. Okay. Actually, I'm playing Weekend Warriors, but sure, man. I'm like, who's that saying something about, like, what? He said, good. <laughs> Yeah, there we go. All right. No, no, no. Wait, 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 wait. You know what? What? I am tired. I'm so tired. It's because we keep staying here. We need to go do something before it gets dark. <laughs> I love the boys. I know. I love it too. They're so cute. Who? You and James. Son. Uh. Uh, 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 uh. 
Mm-hmm. What just happened? Where's the praying hands at? There you go. <laughs> Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. They look so cute in their black and white outfits. <laughs> the what happened? You said they were cute in their black and white outfits. Alright, there you go. <laughs> Going outside when it's cold, I really don't. Well, it's gonna be cold if we don't go out. That's what I'm saying. I don't want to go out. It wasn't cold <laughs> earlier. We would have been good. We could have just been coming back right now. I don't want to go out. Mm-hmm. We'll go out. I said we have all. <laughs> we have all another like five days. We good. You gonna play though when we start walking around somewhere on the learn. Yeah, yeah. So that's when I carry stuff. When you carry stuff. Jada, you carry two bags. Ow, Jada, my bag hurts. Two regular bags. Ow. Say that. That's your cheek. No, but you put your hand on my bag, it hurts. Alright, that's weird. <clears throat> Smooth disc, huh? No, they're not waiting on me. They playing a game right now. <laughs> they both left me to play a game. Aww. No, we didn't. We right here. <laughs> and now waiting on me. They're playing the game, so we cool. We good. I'm tired. I don't want to go to work. They're playing the game. The one what boys and men do play games, which is awesome. I love it though. <laughs> Oh Lord. I'm so sleepy. Everyone hey, left. now I'm in the background like our video. <laughs> Everyone left my live anyway. They probably tired of seeing me. <laughs> they ain't really talking nothing else no more. I know. I'm so tired now. Oh, enjoy yourself, too. Yes, good. thank you. I've been waiting on her to just, uh, not against y'all, but <laughs> I've been trying to get out and do something, so I guess we can call it a quiz now. Man, I don't know how that works. Maybe tomorrow I'll be tired. Oh, yeah, I'm definitely trying to do that while everybody's working. <laughs> we could be left alone. <laughs> definitely. Mm-mm. Especially a hit up that museum. He's staying until Saturday morning. He's leaving Saturday morning. I am. Sat- I am. Next Saturday. <laughs> the 26th. Oh, okay. A whole week, and then I'll go visit him in six weeks. Yeah. Six weeks? Yeah, basically. Six weeks from when he leaves, it'll be six weeks. He wants to go out because he loves going out and walking around. I don't. <laughs> He's a nature man. He loves being outside in nature. He loves walking, being around different things, the people. But I'm a lazy ass. You're a hobo. <laughs> my, yeah, see, my thing is the only reason I'm even like here right now is because I came here to be with her. If I came here to be in New York, I would have been out the room. <laughs> I came here to be with her, so wherever she's at in New York, that's where I'm gonna be at. Yeah. Mm. So, yeah. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Katie, why are you laughing? Are you laughing at me? Because I'm lazy ass, because I am. <laughs> if I don't have to work, if I don't have to go anywhere, I don't go anywhere. I just feel like if you want to put so much energy to work and move for somebody else, 
should do the same energy to have fun and treat yourself. Oh, <laughs> oh somebody convinced her. It's too cold. <laughs> I'm tired. I'm so tired. I'm tired because I've been sitting here. You're just I bet you will walk around you won't be so tired. How am I going to make it better when my feet hurt? From what? From walking around. Where? <laughs> you got to start moving around, baby. My feet just hurt. I'll show him around. He has five days here, five more days here. I'll show him around Manhattan and all that good stuff. You <laughs> said you're too cute or whatever. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yes, I definitely do need rest because, yeah, but I'm good. You better rest because you're going to need yeah. it. Are, are, you, are, are we taking him home? No, my mom's going to come back and get him. She is? Yeah, she's going to come back after she get back from the Bronx. Pick your little boot up. What are you calling <laughs> Cause then I find out y'all don't live that far and shit. I just walk them home if you want. You no, cause there. nobody's home. Oh yeah, yeah. She went to the Bronx and um. True that. True what's the name? Well, I'm not talking about them. I'm just saying. Never, uh, My son stay hating. He always hating on me. What? Cause you see, cause say your son says where? <laughs> cause that's it. My feet have been walking. Yeah, you don't go nowhere. Okay, but I do walk a lot still. Where? When I have to go to work and stuff. I have to walk to work. That's on my feet here. My son's a hater. I'm not no hater. <laughs> you be hating on me. You be hating on me. Laya, laya, pass up by y'all. No. No. <laughs> Whatever. Don't whatever me. Don't whatever me. Line. No, it's my line. Don't whatever. You're, you're far past your teenage years. What are you talking about? Yep, see, see. She said you better rest because you're going to need it, man. You're going to need the rest. Um. So, um, Robin Coles, um, my oldest is six, five, four, baby girl's about to be three, and then baby boy will be two in September. Then you miss one? You said five, four. Wait. Five, four. No, five, no. Six, five. <laughs> yeah, you missed one. Four, no, six, five. Okay, so now your phone does like a feedback thing. Yeah. Yeah, it's making feedback. Echo. How she know I was holding the phone? <laughs> <laughs> okay, repeat the ages again. The oldest is six. Then there's five. And then four. And then baby Two. girl will be three. And one. then uh, baby boy will be two. And one. But my, <laughs> There's no one. But my oldest is going to be seven this year. My second one will be six this year. My third one will be turning five this year. And then, like I said, baby girl will be three. And then baby boy will be two in September. And big boy will be 13. Huh? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Heard it loud and clear. Right. Yas. <laughs> Yas. A lot of babies. Who's one of babies? Not you. Oh. The other ones. Eh. Is that mm-hmm. really baby? I mean, the ones under five. I'm... I mean, I get what he's saying. <laughs> the newbie will be. I'm just saying, after seven, you better Kadeen, cry no, me. not in some months. <laughs> I'm not going to get pregnant this year. That's not. <laughs> Don't say that, Kadeen. I mean, I want a baby, but not yet. 
don't know where it will be some months. No. <sighs> Watching from New Zealand. Hi, how are you? Last name two words. New Zealand? Yeah. Who knows about us all the way over there? <laughs> Whatever is God's will, you can't stop it. The look on his face said, yeah, okay. <laughs> Yes, the look on his face said, yeah, okay. I know. Wait, I'm, what? Okay. <laughs> what are you talking about? When I said, I won't have a baby, that, I wouldn't have one this year. It's you the secret at. women language, man. That's, let them have it. No, when you looked at me when I said I wouldn't have, wouldn't have a baby this year, and you looked no, at me like, <laughs> if I have a baby this year, it's fine, whatever. But not now. How is it fine? Where you, what do you want to take care of that? That's Lady and Jim. Oh, okay. So I need to rest because he's not done yet. <laughs> Can't talk about that. PG-13. PG-13. <laughs> it's a PG-13 live stream. No, it's not. <laughs> Your son is something else. Hi, Luz. What's up? How are you? Lose your mind. That's my sister. You just went to New York and all that. That's my sister. <laughs> <laughs> Guess for the four times. <laughs> what? That's why I'm tired. Guess four times. In two days. Or a day and a half. What? Nothing, dude. Nothing. <laughs> yes, that's my hubby. That's my husband. To be. <laughs> Lou said, hey. How you doing? <clears throat> Thank you. Hey. Oh, he wasn't playing. He never plays. Ever. <laughs> if y'all seen that video she hyped me up on when I talked about the girl with the fupa and her man touching her belly and she got mad that wasn't just for no likes that's really how I feel okay Dean you must not have been here when he picked me up on my live and I got suspended for a second but yeah he's very strong Samson strength yes can somebody say that again okay Dean said your husband yeah your husband looks like he has Samson strength I guess I gotta show him again no <laughs> 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 no, look, look, look. Come here, baby. We'll you better. can't. Yes, look, we'll do it better. Again. Trust me, trust me. Look, look, stand up, baby. We'll do it better. <laughs> no. Look, I got a different way, though. Know? Look, come here, like this. That was scary. Don't do it again. That was scary. <laughs> oh my God. I can't. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put something on the show again. Okay. Why are you moving your feet like that? <laughs> <laughs> You gotta oh stop being stiff, bro. You don't trust me. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Did you see it, Katie? Because my man is it again. I'm scared of heights, okay? Seriously. Heights. And he's, he's like really six feet tall. He's like six feet tall, so yeah. I'm still scared of heights. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, like a baby. Definitely. Because <laughs> she don't, she's little. I keep trying to tell her that she's small compared to what I'm used to. She is small. Oh my god, got my butt all in the freaking camera. Oh <laughs> but I like how somebody said I got Samson strength instead of Hercules white ass. <laughs> <laughs> Ready to show me off. Um, That's why they call me Luke Cage. <laughs> He's always ready to go somewhere. I'm tired. <laughs> Y'all, Kayute, thank you. Kayute. Kayute, thank you. <laughs> another, uh, another phrase in women language. Whatever, with your <laughs> John. Mr. Philly. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Thank you, thank you. Okay, Katie, do not ask to see that again because I'm tired. 
And then uh, one more time. Then. No. Come on. No, 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 no. No one yeah. asked. Nobody asked. Nobody <laughs> asked. He's here till. <laughs> He's here till Saturday morning. Next Saturday morning. Come on, let's do it one more time. Let's give no, him, let's no, no, let's no, give no, him no, a better yeah, one. Yeah. Nobody come asked. On. Nobody asked. Let's give him the better one. Come on, come on. Nobody let's asked. Let's give him a better one. Oh, my God. Let's no, just give him a better one. It goes a script. It's 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 a script. Don't do it. Don't turn like that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Stop. All right. Come on. God. Oh, my God. Okay. I said no more demonstrations. Be good. No more demonstrations. Yeah, TikTok. <laughs> Damn that. Oh my god. Yeah. Uh uh. Who said throw up on the wall? No no no. No no TikTok. We're not doing that. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> I mean, yeah, I did that anyway, so, anyway. <laughs> Where you get that from, Amazon? No. I got it from TikTok. <laughs> you he's, not, he's not on Amazon Prime, sorry. <laughs> we'll go out tomorrow. I'm yeah, you know what? Jaden kind of did save the day, so it wouldn't be blocked. <laughs> <laughs> Jump this whole face in there. <laughs> the plans for dates, I don't know. Whatever. Go well, with the flow. We got five days, so every day is going to be a date. If she wants it. Mm -hmm. The date can be right here. She's been tired. She's been working hard, so the date can just be consistent of me giving her a full body massage and just watching her fall asleep. I'm cool with that. As long as I know she's satisfied, she's safe, and she's at peace, that's all that matters to me. <laughs> she told my Miss Lady Jones told my Jaden said said he's like, hey, I'm here, so nothing's going on. <laughs> Sure that. Kadeen, thank you. Yes, I'm always considerate of others because I'm a simple man. Real men are simple men. I don't really ask for too much. I don't need too much. As long as, uh, as long as everything for her is cool, I'm cool. <laughs> yeah, that's a perfect plan. I mean, he's already done that already. So the massage and stuff. <laughs> The massages and stuff. And stuff. We are both Gemini's. <laughs> Two Gemini's dating. People think that's crazy, but don't really care. Okay. There's plenty of signs that, that have dated each other. I've seen Pisces go together. <laughs> Why you say, oh Lord, because we're two Gemini's? Oh well. That's us to deal with, not you. <laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Somebody said, scoop up your lady, bro. Get New heavyweight champ. Tenacious. Hello, and I'm Rusty, too. Gemini's bring the energy. Throw up on the wall. <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah, we talk all the time. Sometimes we'd be on the phone for like four or five, six hours at a time. Oh, appreciate that, Kadeen. She said Gemini is always good with words, have the right answer. 
Yeah, we always have good conversation, always. When we are talking on the phone. Yeah, Jay didn't kind of say that one, because y'all yeah. definitely would have had to be ghost right now. <laughs> Damn, TikTok. <laughs> Huh? What are you even looking Somebody, at? Somebody, she, uh, she Teresa said I wasn't being that rude. I wasn't being rude then. Cause she was talking about the the signs us being Gemini. Oh nah, I wasn't. I wasn't saying you was being rude. That's just how I answer things. Yeah, don't 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 take that like something serious. I mean, that's just how I am. We both feel fine. Skating, I don't skate. I'm just live and uncut. Oh, I skate. I, know. I skate, roller skate, rollerblade, all that. I, I used to play hockey in high school, so I'm I even figure skate. I don't skate. <laughs> I don't skate. I don't because I I fell before and it hurt a lot and I couldn't breathe and that was not fun. Thank you. Damn, both of your parents are Gemini's? <laughs> yes. Me and my man are the same to the X sign and we were like a damn mirror. <laughs> huh? Luz said her and her man are the same sign and they're like a damn mirror. They're like a mirror. That's awesome, Luz. That's what's up. Luz is the one that makes those cool vampire videos and stuff. Vampire Like, she'll do like transition videos where she'll go from regular to like vampire or regular to like like some mythical creature type stuff so <laughs> like, like that's true just, like she's really good like all these people be cosplaying like they from middle earth or something yeah like she's really good the elves and well yeah I gotta do another one else I love you for infinity oh 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 <laughs> <Okay>, like <laughs> Luz, your videos are awesome. I love your videos. Don't talk about you're not all that. You are, though. Your videos are so awesome. She's trying too hard to be modest. I love your videos. They are so good. Listen, modesty don't get you nowhere. Be a fucking monster. You know you're good at what you do. Don't ever stop for nobody. Plans for the future is me or us moving. Me and my son moving to Cali. Uh, Wedding. And living life and having fun. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's all it is. <laughs> Something new now. Something new. Dun, 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 dun. I've never been married, so it's all new for me. Traditional wedding? No. The only thing new for me is the fact of where we're going to live. Neither one of us has been there. You said I could be so, a bridesmaid. Sure, you could be a bridesmaid. That's like the only thing new for me. But the wedding will be traditional <sighs> slash non-traditional. It's not very traditional, not really. Kind of, but not really. Asia, hi! How are you? Your best friend. Asia Blue, what it do? Really? That's my older sister right there. Um, Asia, you were definitely going to go live when we get married. For sure. TikTok wedding. <laughs> Asia, my big sister. Somebody named Luff Scruppy just, uh, or Luff Scruppy Some just Something told me long ago I'm driving though. No problem, but thank you for coming, Asia. I love you. Hey, don't be logging in while you drive it. Come on, man. <laughs> I appreciate the support, but I'm all about people being safe and smart, man. Please. At least pull over or something. <laughs> she's always driving. Driving her kids around, her grandkids around. Doing something. She's always busy. A busy mama and a busy grandma. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what are you looking at? Huh? What are you looking at? Thank you, Love Scra uh, Scrappy. I'm say your name wrong. Love Scrappy. <laughs> <laughs> My dress will probably be like ivory color or off white or definitely not white. 
close to white, but not white, basically. Maybe even beige. I don't know. I'm still thinking about it. And um, the style is going to be... I don't know. I still think about that too, actually. I'm not writing vows, just saying what we feel. I'm not really writing any vows. Just say what we feel. Like I said, we're mixing it. Not, nobody's really caring too hard to be traditional, but we're not also so modern either so it's like we, we we mixing it you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. so when it comes to vows yes we're still gonna do vows but um you know one thing i'm gonna do like i did with my last wedding is i'm gonna be truthful so when i say my vows i'm gonna look her dead in her eyes and i'm gonna tell her exactly how she makes me feel i don't need no paper i don't need to remember nothing because it's from my heart we've been together for four and a half months and it might be fast for some people but we really don't care so if you're gonna hate on a relationship, then don't follow me. You can leave. Like, honestly. Like, I'm talking about judging us for the fact that we're engaged already. Yeah, but we also live apart. And that is my first time seeing him. So, if you're not gonna support a relationship, you can get up my life right now. Thank you. Truth. Like, get the hell out, seriously. Especially if you're a dude, Hayden. Like, get out. Mm. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Mm. Like, you don't even know me, so don't come in asking questions. I'll block you. Or get my moderators to block you. Like, how, what is it? Thank you for blocking him. Thank you. Because I was about to. Blocking who? Because this guy came in and he was like, how fast did this happen? Yeah, all the dudes want all. I noticed that with you dudes, like all y'all so worried about how fast we doing this or, or this, that, and the third. Like, why, why y'all worried about it? Like, fuck. You ain't got your own woman. <laughs> Thank you for blocking him because I was about to. Because like he hated on my video too. He was like saying some stupid comment. Like, what does that matter to you? I don't even know you. The anyway. Language. <laughs> Language. Thank you for, for helping me. Yes, him and my son got along amazingly. And they did talk before he came. They talk on the phone and video chat whenever they can. If you really want to know how long, how good we get along, he told me he will accept me adopting him. <laughs> I know you're quick with the fingers. <laughs> I know I saw you block him as soon as <laughs> like I saw it, like yo. <laughs> she means the blocking fingers. But yeah. Oh yeah, he did. He commented on the video. He said, "Did did I pay for his ticket to come here?" I'm like, it's not even your business. If I did, I did. If I didn't, I didn't. Whatever, not your business. So if I did, and it's 2022, men don't have to do everything by themselves. Like, come on now. I don't know people think that men have to do everything. We can do some things for them, too. Well, see, that's the type of woman I got. I couldn't even tell her, no. <laughs> this is what she wanted, so I made it happen the best way I could. Y'all want to judge my character for that? Then, like she said, go kick rocks. She just didn't go book business facts. Like, yo, it's always guys hating or or ladies that have been in long distance relationships and it didn't work out. So they think that ours won't work out, but they don't know us. So it might be fast on how we're moving because we're going to be living together in a few months, but yeah. that's what we want. So, and we're happy and in love. So. Mm. Stay at a phone phone I literally love that. Like, yeah. Oh, you bought your man's ticket before? That's awesome. No, I'm moving to Cali. Not Florida. No offense to Florida, but no. Cali. <laughs> I'm moving 2,000 miles away from my original home. And I'm happy about it, so. 
<laughs> you need to move to Cali. You should. It's beautiful there. <laughs> you think you're trying to move out of Michigan? I feel you. Thank you. Yeah, I heard the snow is not my friend. <laughs> the snow's not my friend either. I hate the uh, snow. God, y'all with that, man. I love the cold. How you from New York? You don't like the cold? Cause I'm a summer baby. Those snowball fights, man. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> I've never been across the country either. This will be my first time going across the country for anything. So yeah. I've only been on a plane one time when I was a kid, so. Do you know her? Mm, no. Okay. Nope, there is no age gap. We are the same exact age. Literally. <laughs> same age, same zodiac sign. I'm a month older than her, that's it. Less than that, like three weeks. Oh, yeah, three weeks older than her. Because so, yeah, I'm June 18. Real twins. I'm tired, but I'm good. I'm just chilling on this table right now. <laughs> Yo, ever since we did this live, everybody keeps coming on to you. <laughs> Thank y'all, everybody who keeps liking this one. This was for her. That was my Valentine's Day gift. You got a the first birthday for he outdoes yours. The what? She said, oh, you got to outdo him for his birthday before he outdoes yours. You for yours. I mean, we won't be together for our birthdays. So we'll have to celebrate later. His birthday will be... Actually, for your birthday, when that kind of when we were talking about that you would be heading that way or I'd be taking a trip up here to help you move there. Like... We'll, we'll be together probably for my birthday, maybe, but um, for his, I won't be able to see him face to face. So, we'll have to do something later on together, which is fine. Yeah, our, our wedding is um, between our birthdays. It's going to be between our birthdays. So yeah, it's gonna be one big celebration for real. Cause he's his birthday's May six, his is May twenty fourth. Our wedding is bef um, around that time, and then my birthday is June eighteen. So May birthdays, June celebrations, birthdays, graduations. Cause my son will be graduating from eighth grade next year, and he'll be going to high school next year. So a lot of celebrations happening next year. And this year. <laughs> this is my son's last year in middle school. Well, no, technically next year. It's last year in middle school. You know what's so funny, Ben? Mm -hmm. Not even you. Well, no, you did. I forgot you did do it. But mm -hmm. this video, everybody is all hyped about how I look in the video, but nobody do edit it. <laughs> <laughs> all right, y'all want to probably scared. <laughs> I might see him for his birthday. I don't know. Maybe. We'll see. Actually, she's coming to see me, like, my way. And we'll go live on that, too. So we'll be live in Cali around April because she'll be coming to see me um, in April. So um, technically, she'll be around me getting close to my birthday. But I won't really see them for Jaden's birthday or my birthday. Like, in the actual birthday, no. Yeah, my son's birthday is May 6th. We see Cup. May 6th, 2009. That's crazy. He's May 6th. And I saw it's June 7th. <laughs> and whoever came in from the airport video, the story is, we met on TikTok. He found me. Uh... We started talking September 25th um, and now four and a half months in we are now engaged and planning on living together in the next few months and that's the story and that's my son back there yes hashtag black love 
<laughs> yes, he has kids. Five. Five beautiful kids. Oh, speaking on that whole black thing, please, my black people, know your, know your, know your, know your bloodline, know your DNA, okay? Because black is not a race. It's not even a culture. All right, my indigenous people. I'm Gullah Geechee, and eighty percent of us that are from this land are Gullah Geechee. Please learn your roots. Learn your roots. Thank you for saying congrats. Thank you, thank you. But thank you for coming in from the airport video. That's awesome. Who did? Robin the bank. She saw the airport video and it came to the live. Robin the bank. <laughs> Robin the bank. <laughs> I like that name. You know, it'd be mad, mad funny if she had just put Robin Banks. Because it would have sound, <laughs> sounded like a real first and last name, too. Yeah. But, yeah. TikTok love story. Currently in progress. Because it's still happening. <laughs> And I should what ask what most asked questions on your live. Um, we've been doing that so I mean today so far. The most asked questions is when is the wedding, uh, and how we met basically. <laughs> <laughs> Why would I name a dog TikTok? <laughs> Give me a TikTok. Give me. A... I don't want to name a puppy TikTok. Let me find something better than that. <laughs> Sorry, pin your voice. <laughs> Yo, for any millennials in here, if I was going to name a dog some weird ass name like that, I'd rather name him Nanook. So if you know what movie that is, mm-hmm. write that down, down in there. Oh, TT for short. <laughs> TT for short. TikTok, TT. TT. See, he don't know, he don't know about Nanook. Lost Boys. Somebody said it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Asia, she's a millennial too. Robin the Bank. Well, yeah. Robin Banks is the name of a... Oh, okay. I either Uh-oh. name my next dog Nanook or Cujo. Oh, that's a... Cool. Okay. An XXX star? I didn't know that. Robin Banks. I never heard of that person. But okay. That's a... Oh, yeah. I don't know. But that is that really her right there? No, she said that that makes the name of a, a star, oh, adult yeah. star. No, it is. That's why I was laughing at first because I was like, "She said Lord Cujo." Huh? He just said Lord Cujo. <laughs> that was my dog, man. That's not even a good name for a dog. Why not? <laughs> The dog was possessed because he had rabies. He said, not that scary. That name for That's what I'm saying. That name is scary. I don't want that name for that dog. was a good name. Cujo. That was really a cool name. The dog is Cujo was the first horror movie that involved a dog trying to eat a family. Oh. I like Biscuit or something like that. So I'm cute. Oh, my God. I'm not naming. I'm not naming. I'm I'm going to tell you this right now. (laughs) If we get any animal... And you name that animal after some tasty cake shit. <laughs> you're taking care of that. Because I already know how it went in the family. Everybody want a pet. But the husband's always the one taking care of the damn pet. But I'm not taking care of no pet named Biscuit. <laughs> no, not Benji. Benji, that's so sad. I'm, no, no, no not Benji. Even, not even that. Benji? No. What are we, white? No. No. Not doing that. Biscuit. Benjamin TikTok. Benjamin. I don't even think nobody even. What about that Squidward? No, that name Squidward. even exists anymore? I don't know. Why are we like naming dogs head. right now? We're it's not like getting a dog. Not right now. It's like an old head name. Benjamin. Benjamin. What about Roscoe? No. I don't know why we're talking about dog names. Because that okay. just makes me think of chicken. <laughs> chicken and waffles. Roscoe. Nah. Like I said, if I gave me a dog, his name is Nanook or Cujo. Either one. I don't know why I talk about dog names. I want a baby first. A dog. I don't need a puppy. I want human babies. Yeah, we're trying to get babies. I'm not going live. Leave me alone. We're going to get babies before we get pets. 
I don't really believe in pets, man. Every animal should be allowed to be free, just like every human. So, I don't really believe in pets. Mm. If I had any animal living with us, he'd just be in the yard, free to do what he want. How many kids do we want? Um, Together? Uh, three. <laughs> Hopefully. Just like... Hey, hey. <laughs> yeah, we want three kids. At least. That would be nice. So there'll be nine kids all together. Nine kids? She's Louise. <laughs> <laughs> She's Louise. I um, thought we said 12. What happened? Wait, I what? Get nine. <laughs> I can get nine. Um, Jaden, do you Cause. want a sister or a brother? Both are fine. See, so he wants both. Personally, though, out of the options, probably a sister because... I already have a so-called brother, and it's annoying. So. Oh yeah, Aaron. That's different, Jaden. <laughs> they, they, that's that's your and so-called yeah. brother because y'all have to live together. And yeah, so that's age. why y'all just don't click because y'all don't really get along. Y'all don't really vibe like that. But if you had a brother straight from your mother, I'm pretty sure you're gonna have a whole different connection with him. My son loves kids younger than him, so he'll be fine oh, with yeah. either one. He's good with kids. He's good with kids, babies, toddlers. He's almost a teenager, so he's good with anybody, any kids. I got him. DZ said you'd be an awesome big brother. Thank you. See you, Asia. Love you. Talk to you later. Text me. Thank you for coming. Text me. Talk to you later. <laughs> That's my big sister right there. Look, one from Texas. Texas. The one? She's from Texas. That's the one from Texas. And what? Oh, Reese Cups said, can you please explain about being black and it not being a culture, please? Okay, once again, I said, I don't, uh, like, I don't follow the system and all that. I don't follow what people say. I don't follow how the media, and I damn sure don't follow what a white person's trying to title us. I don't, I don't do that. So, when I said that, I said, please know your roots because black is not a race, it is not a culture, it's just a, it's a color. That is literally all that word is. It's just a color. And the funny thing is, the only thing black on us is our hair. So, therefore, I know my roots and I pray that all my people of this land know their self because not only are we indigenous of this land, but 80%, 80 of us from this land are Gullah Geechee. Look up the Gola Islands off the Carolina, uh, off the Carolinas. You know that that long sea island right there off the Carolinas. That's where our people reside. You know that's Gola Island right there, Gola Geechee. So instead of just trying to say black power, black love, actually know where you come from, you individually, because it's not about history. It's about your story. So know your story instead of just claiming something just so so it can go along with everybody else. You know what I'm saying? So when people ask me, no, I'm not black. I'm Gullah Geechee and Wichita Indian. <laughs> Big facts. Facts. Thank you. <laughs> now, with that being said, oh, thank you. I will. I will definitely get home safe. But like I, as that being said though, even though I said all that, I'm not one to tell anybody how to live or how to speak because I don't believe in that. I'm gonna be me regardless of what you think. I won't judge you for nothing as long as you mind your business about me being me. So with that being said, if somebody says, oh, black power, black love, oh, that's all great, but don't expect me to say that because I don't believe in that. <laughs> I mean, I don't think percentage really matters. If you are what you are and it's in your DNA, then that's what you are. The percentage really don't matter. That percentage shit is just to satisfy white supremacy so that they can feel comfortable about you. But I'm literally 50-50 because my mom is the one where I get all that from from my mom. My mom's my mom's mom 
is Gullah Geechee, literally born and raised in Charleston, South Carolina. And then um, her dad is Wichita Indian, like dead ass. I mean, he's dead now, but yeah, he was native, like all the way, Native American. <laughs> Now, if y'all really want to get t technical, my dad's side of the family, I'm Brazilian and um, in Philippines. <laughs> when people are born now, I'm sorry. You said what? Yeah, the people are born now, we left like 17 people. <laughs> oh, that's fine. That's cool. All right, well, we're going to say goodnight. And I'm going to go ahead and put her to bed. So <laughs> thank y'all for showing up. Andy. We'll talk to y'all next time. You got to end it, right? No, not really. <laughs> I only ask because I know someone who's... She broke some things down. Oh, no, I get that. I understand that. No judgment. I just... uh. I don't really believe it. I don't believe in the whole percentage thing. Like I've been to, I've been to two different uh, reservations before. You know what I'm saying? So when I told them what I was, and um, they seen how like very uh, educated I was about the culture of the native, uh, the native culture of this land, they they accepted me. They didn't care about what percentage I was and anything like that. Now. Truth be told, if I'm a certain percentage, then yeah, I can live in the reservations under their culture and not have to worry about American society. But I, I it's not a big deal for me because I'm good no matter where I go. So, mm -hmm. but um, yeah, we gonna say good night. <laughs> She's about to eat, about to get ready to call her tonight. I think it's the three dot. No, no, Mrs. And right there. Uh, button. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all. Thank y'all so much once again for coming, checking us out, seeing our story, hearing us. Um, thank y'all for supporting this beautiful woman on what she wanted in life, which was me. But we want to say goodnight now and we'll check up with y'all a little later in the week before I leave. All right. Y'all be safe. Yeah. So like my slogan, motivating people motivates me. Y'all be safe. Be on your toes. Be lethal. Us.